So, I know a lot of you are probably wondering, why is Adonis such an asshole? Well, this video will give some background information and maybe make you feel bad for him. Basically, his parents always expected too much from him. And he always struggled in school because he has some problems. He never fully understood the work that was assigned to him, and he would try his best to get good grades, but it never worked out. And he would always get bullied for being st the stupid kid, and he never really had any popularity in elementary school or middle school, and he never really had any true friends. But one day, his parents kicked him out of the house because he was never good enough for them. So he was sent to live with his sister. At that moment, he felt unwanted and useless and worthless. He just hated himself and he changed. When he was a freshman in high school, he started to take his anger out on people and bully people, but he gained more friends because of that, Sylvie and Val, because they were also jerks. So they kind of became popular kids together, and that just made him feel like he was wanted. Okay, kind of backtracking, but have you ever noticed that Adonis always wears long sleeves, he never really shows his arms. Well, a little trigger warning, so at the young age, if he was in like third grade, all of the bullying and a mental abuse from his parents and just like a lot of stuff going on around him, he self-harmed. And he did that a lot through elementary school and middle school. He stopped during freshman year, but the scars are still there and so he hides them. Another reason why he started bullying is to get like revenge or just to just to make people feel what he felt for all those years. So he felt happy finally having friends, but he was really happy when he met Monica and then eventually got together with Monica. And so you can imagine why he was so upset when Monica broke up with him. And when he told Vivian to kill herself and then lost his friends and then popularity and he lost Monica, he was kind of back to where he was in elementary school and middle school. And so you can imagine how that feels for him. But when Axel was being nice to him, he felt wanted by at least one person. And so that's why he kind of is sticking with Axel because everyone else basically hates him so he's just wanting someone to defend him. So yeah that's basically the quick run through of why he is the way he is. So yeah that's just the explanation and see ya!